can't take a break here and uh, get myself uh, situated again and see if I can't get this. Come on, just fall down the hole. There we go. It's usually just easiest to hold the the direction you want to go rather than just jumping. Because if you do hit one of those uh, bounce bouncing spheres, you'll get hit. This one is a path. There we go. Alright. I'll go ahead and save it here. There we go. Okay, so. We done that. Come on. Nope, 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 nope. Yeah. And the goal, uh, the goal spheres are, are in a lot better areas to trap you. Especially if you start jumping around, you'll get stuck there visibly, so you want to be very careful about it. And there you go, all you gotta do is just touch the emerald and you're done. Okay, so... There we go, thankfully. I mean, the rings I got, but I'll just take a look at it again. And so we got two emeralds. We just need two more, I'll be a, I should be able to get them in the, in the next the last two areas that I can easily get them at. Come on. Alright, let's see. This one is a lot longer and has a lot more differing paths that you can go. And there are a lot of underground sec sections but air in the uh, side get into. This should be the first area where we see a crab meat. If I would if I would have waited any longer, he would to go over there would have shot his uh, energy spheres at me and hit and had to do the wait for him to move or get cr uh, or potentially could have gotten crushed come on just want to make sure you be very careful when dealing with these they don't seem that hard until you get somewhere like here so it's down here okay so there's nothing down there so you don't gotta worry about jumping down there so and I'll probably get since it's taking way too long to do this about I'm gonna start cutting the videos up and I hate to I'd, lo I'd love to do all do the whole zone in one video but just taking too long especially with the chaos emeralds so I'm going to start cutting the videos up. I'll probably cut this video up about uh, somewhere during the Chaos Emerald. When I was getting the Chaos Emerald. And as you can see, Speed Shoes. We haven't seen those yet, but they will let us run a lot faster. And coupled with the uh, shield we got, this, this will make it a lot really fun to run around and... And as you can see, the uh, music does speed up while you have the speed shoes on, so that'll let you know how long you have them. As soon as the music goes slower, you'll know you ran out of the uh, speed shoes. Let's see, come on. There we go. This should be the... Getting close to the end. Let me see where we're at exactly. Can usually remem rem can remember memorize these levels and uh, be able to know how quickly I am to the end of one. That is actually very lucky to jump up there on the first shot rather than having to mess around on the bottom. This it'll make it a lot easier while going through here. Okay, so uh, my bad. I've never actually been up there before. But this, yeah, okay, we're right there by the boss, so. Let's see. You gotta be very careful through here because it's a bottomless pit down there and you will die. Always wanna make sure you look down before you jump. Now this is an interesting boss because what he'll do is he'll uh, come down at you with a spike and take up one of these blocks, robbing you of a place to run. So you have to jump, and as you can see, he is moving. Crap. Uh, 
uh, he is moving up and down, and you can only hit him when he comes down far enough. There we go, okay. So this is the Spring Yard Zone. I thank you for watching. The challenge of the video is how many rings that I collect in the entire Spring Yard Zone, including the uh, Chaos Emeralds. Thank you for watching. Until next time.